Hi, this is Chris from vitamincm.com, and today we're going to talk about taking the contents of an RSS feed and displaying it inside of a web page. We're going to do this using a service called Feed Twister at feedtwister.com. So I need to get the URL for the uh, feed that I want to use. I'm going to go over here to my Yahoo Pipes page and use the feed that I created the other day. So I have the feed up. It's called What I'm Reading. I need to get the URL here. So here's the URL, so I'll just copy it down. Go back to Feed Twister, and I want to go to My Account, and I want to create a new list. So I'll call it My Bookmarks. I need to paste in that URL that I just grabbed, so I'll paste that in here and click Create. This is going to create a piece of code. So if I go down here to this HTML section, I'll just grab the piece of code that I created. Now I'm going to go over to the editor for my blog, and I have an article here that's called What I'm Reading, and I put in information saying that it's my uh, favorites from Delicious Dig, uh, Stumble Upon. And here's what the article looks like right now, so there's no uh, feed information in it. I'm going to go back to my editor, you can just paste in the piece of JavaScript provided by Feed Twister, and save the page. When it's done saving, you can go back to the page and hit refresh. And you'll see all the different bookmarks. These are all the different items in the RSS feed displayed. You can read part of the text on some of them depending on which service they came from. If you want to open them up in a separate window, you can do that. So, so that's how you would add an RSS feed into the uh, web page and display its contents.